Hello and happy February to everyone. This is James Henderson, president of the Florida Speakers Association. I can tell you what, it's great to be here in South Florida. I could be in Philly right now. I'm here soaking up the sun, the beach air, playing golf, having the blessing of calling a 60 degree day cold. That's awesome. Well, here in February, FSA is gonna keep it hot for you. Starting off with our monthly webinar series. This month is gonna be awesome. Remember, these are included in your chapter dues, so all you have to do is get the link and tune in. Now, on the 9th, John Colby is going to start that off, and his title is Yes And, and he's going to talk about how to improve communication through le and leadership through improv, all right? Now, our February chapter meeting, we're going to bring in another Hall of Fame speaker, and that speaker is going to be the wildly entertaining Mickey Williams. Mickey's been des described as a disruptor and a maverick, and she's mastered the art of changing the game. She's been named one of the top speakers in the country by Meetings and Conventions Magazine. She was the first American speaker to tour South Africa after, after apartheid and actually spoke in the home of Nelson Mandela. Add that to having spoken twice at the White House, I'd say that Mickey has established herself both home and abroad. So do not miss Mickey Williams on Saturday, February the 13th. Go to your website and register right now. Now, if that's not enough to make you register right now, here's the icing on the cake. February is President's Month, and on Saturday the 13th, we're going to give all of our past, our past presidents a welcome and a thank you like Abraham Lincoln never had. But wouldn't you know it that in the spirit of Cavett, a number of our past presidents are going to give right back to you. They're going to be sharing their ethical legacy and how FSA has been shaped over the years through each of their tenures as president. So again, stop what you're doing. Go register now. This is going to be chock full of information, and it's going to be a great opportunity to say thank you to all our past presidents. I can tell you that it's an honor. It's been a growth experience, and sometimes it's been a downright challenge to serve you. But I wouldn't trade anything over the last two years of board service. Even after a year where nothing went anything like I could imagine, I'm still thrilled to start next year with Dr. Rachel Cartwright and Fabio Marquez and help them raise the bar on what FSA can be. That's exactly where you come in. Now, even though the current board had lots, has lots of work to do, we still got six months. It's still time for us to begin looking at the 2021-2022 board. So first, if you're a professional member and you're interested in being actively involved, collaborating with an amazing team and contributing to the foundation of leadership of Florida Speakers Association, here's what I'd like you to do. I'd like you to reach out to Dr. Rachel Cartwright or to, or to Jean Maroney, who's our membership chair, and express your interest. Now, if you've spotted somebody else that you feel uh, is, first of all, a professional member, but you feel they have the leadership skills to help build our chapter and move our chapter forward and to participate in leadership, go ahead and give their name to either Rachel or Jean. And we'll share all the particulars of the positions, the responsibilities, possible time constraints, everything that goes with it. I'm gonna give you a little short introduction of the positions and how those positions play into what we're doing. Now, I will continue next year as the immediate past president. The president next year will be Dr. Rachel Cartwright. Our president-elect will be Fabio Marquez. And next, the first open position is vice president. Could this be you? I mean, the vice president will become the next president-elect of the Florida Speakers Association. This person's identified as part of the long range succession plan for our chapter leadership. Secretary. The secretary is gonna be responsible for proper recording and maintenance of our chapter minutes, of board meetings, and she serves as an advisor in all the board decisions. The treasurer. Our treasurer is responsible for accurate bookkeeping and oversight of the board in all financial matters. Now, you don't need to be a CPA, we will ask you for a two-year commitment to be the treasurer. Next is the director of membership. Now, we're looking for a relationship expert who can be a liaison to
to current professional members, to candidates from the NSA ranks who are unaffiliated with the chapter, to our aspiring speakers, to our academy members, in order to build on membership growth. A director of communications. This member is going to expand on our social media presence and add to our members and our chapter's presence on social media as it relates to Florida Speakers Association. And then we'll have at least one at-large member. And those at-large members will be asked to serve at chapter events, participate in outreach, and be asked to provide support for the president and the rest of the board. Again, I feel like I've been incredibly blessed to have served this chapter and to continue to serve this chapter. And I know that there are many of you who could make a huge difference in our continued growth and in our continued efforts to provide outstanding value to every single member. I want you to feel free to reach out to me or to Rachel or to Jean, any of us to ask questions about the responsibilities and duties. I know I've spoken a little bit longer than most of the other monthly messages, but I believe that the future of this chapter is extremely bright and it's you who's gonna to continue to add polish and shine to FSA. Now, I'll be personally reaching out to some people and I also look forward to finishing out this year strong with our current board. I just want to let you know that, that I am honored to be your president, and I'd like for each of you to share that honor with me next year as part of our 2021-2022 board. So until we again speak, hopefully in person, hopefully very soon, I'd like for all of you to be extremely, incredibly blessed.